Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Guys, do you know the phrase matchy matchy? Guys, does it drive you crazy that I'm wearing an Under Armour hat with a Nike shirt, uh, Lulu jacket, Lulu pants, a6 shoes right so i'm misbranded here does it drive you crazy that i'm doing this because my it drives my buddy eugene crazy because he loves it when people are matchy matchy and kind of like dressed to the hilt in the same brand name so if I'm wearing all Adidas, I should be head to toe Adidas or like this. Do you prefer me trying to be a little matchy matchy like this? At least I have Navy here. I'm getting close though, guys. I'm getting real close. Um, or do you prefer brand consciously matching? I know Eugene does, but you know, since all of us aren't sponsored and get the clothes for free, uh, like the pros do on television in which the manufacturers like Nike, Adidas, uh, Lotto, Asics, right? All those guys pretty much, oh, don't forget Lacoste, uh, dress everybody. I mean, they say, basically, they just throw boxes of clothes uh, to them and they say, wear this, wear this outfit for Wimbledon, wear this outfit for the French, wear this outfit for this tournament. So you guys probably don't know this, but every box of clothes that the pros get is all, it's marked. Like you wear this for this tournament once this tournament is over those go away and you wear the next group of of clothing so basically what they wear is what's being sold so those of you who say oh yeah i want that sample shirt from 20 years ago yeah unless nike decides that they want to bring it back uh in a retro og look uh you're gonna have to go to eBay and buy somebody's 20 year old shirt that hopefully been sitting in their closet. Uh, so back to matchy matchy. This is about as matchy as I get. Um, back in the day, I actually used to get a bunch of Reebok stuff that uh, Michael Chang used to wear. Plus those pump shoes from back in the day. Uh, and they used to send me a bunch of clothes that I didn't wear. So, when Reebok ruled the world, I got a lot of clothes. I, I would literally get cases and cases of clothes. Um, Warm-ups, uh, crazy looking polos, crazy looking shorts, uh, pump shoes, um, like four times a year. It was kind of ridiculous how much stuff I got. Uh, I think the Goodwill benefited from that because I couldn't wear half the stuff. Uh, it was just way out there, way out there. Um, but today, you know, these guys aren't as, you know, they're not as giving as they used to be. So, but you know, my buddy Todd, you know, suit, suited me up with the Mizuno stuff. So, uh, I'm pretty happy about that. Uh, but this is about as matchy matchy as I get. So in order, if I was going to wear like all of the same brand, I mean, I'm probably not going to like a piece of that as you guys probably wouldn't either. So I'm guessing you guys just wear what's comfortable to you as long as they don't clash too much uh, in color. Um, I don't know if brand is that big of a deal in this day and age. So, but let me know, um, cause I know it bugs Eugene when, you know, we got Adidas uh, top with a Nike bottom. It's like, oh man, clash of the, the top and the bottoms. You know, they kind of fight, so. But, but let me know, does it bug you? Uh, or do you like matchy-matchy? Or do you matchy-matchy? Okay, 
Thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Strike the pose. <laughs>